The nursing category is cardiac. The NCLEX category is physiological adaptation. Which of the following would be considered a non-shockable rhythm when assessing cardiac function during a cardiac arrest code? A. Pulseless electrical activity, PEA. B. Ventricular fibrillation. C. Ventricular tachycardia. D. Torsade de point. Again, which of the following would be considered a non-shockable rhythm when assessing cardiac function during a cardiac arrest code? A. Pulseless electrical activity, PEA. B. Ventricular fibrillation. C. Ventricular tachycardia. D. Torsade de point. The correct answer is A. Pulseless electrical activity, PEA. During a code for client resuscitation, the team may be able to shock the client's heart to get it to start beating in a normal pattern. However, there are some rhythms that are considered non-shockable, which means that even if the heart is shocked, it would not restore a heartbeat. Pulseless electrical activity, PEA, is a state in which there is an electrical activity that can be seen on the monitor, but there is no heart rhythm. Because the heart is not actually beating, the client does not have a pulse. This condition cannot be corrected by administering a shock. This has been another episode of the Nursing.com NCLEX Question of the Day podcast. If you want to take 21 other practice quizzes, head over to nursing.com slash pop quiz. That's nursing.com slash pop quiz. You guys can pass the NCLEX. We can help. Happy nursing.